So I just got back from a ride a little while ago and um, thought I'd use this as a cool down. So what I did was I modified the slack block because I found it actually wasn't that hard, wasn't that difficult. And I, what I did was product showcase, took out the cores in the middle. Took out one, that didn't do anything. Took out two, that didn't do anything. So that said, screw it, I took out all five. That did something. And what it really does is um, makes it laterally unstable um, to the point where like, now it's challenging. And so I try to do two minutes on each foot. Um, the right foot is just because I'm right dominant is easy to do two minutes. I wouldn't say easy. 130 is, is pretty easy for the last 30 seconds. Is slightly challenging but the left foot for sure is much more difficult um, and what I notice is is on the um, where you really feel it are the stabilizing muscles on the outside of your calves uh, particularly the, these muscles right here so that's kind of cool you know um, and what I noticed is is when you get on the edge when you're about to teeter-totter it's really hard to recover that um, you think you can but then it's just really difficult. So, um, yeah, I, I really like this thing, especially with all five cores missing, uh, pulled out of it, because it, it really does add something to um, my training. Um, I'd like to try to integrate it in something else, maybe get another one and um, try to do squats on it or something like that. I tried doing it on, uh, on squats, doing on, on one, and it's a little too unstable, but yeah, so that, that's that.